welcome or welcome back to the channel thanks for stopping by hope you're good and welcome to another animal book club unboxing yeah. <laughs> best time of the month because i get to bring my boy on yeah. right shall we dive straight into it yes if you hear noises we've had to have the window open because it's so hot okay let me open it that was right, are you ready yeah that was a meaty one today well, then. Let's see what we got. What are you grabbing? Do oh. I do pre love first? Oh, we're doing. Oh, we've got two bookmarks. Ooh, some scary rats. Oh, oh, uh, it's a James Herbert uh, for the rats. With oh, a bit from the rats on it. And then that's our bookmark with our short story on the back. Mommy, you better not show me that rat. Oh, I'll turn it the other way. There you go. Let's do pre-love first, please. Why do you want pre-love? Because I do. <laughs> Yay! Pre-love book! <laughs> bah, bah, bah. Ooh, that was easy, this one. Yeah. No, I can do that. Oh, sorry. Did you forget? You told off. <laughs> now, get this bit. Ooh, this one didn't have the... Ooh, it's a... Oh, it's Hannibal! It's like a hardback. It is a hardback. Okay, so it's Hannibal by uh, Thomas Harris. This is The Return of Hannibal Lecter, so it is the second one, and I haven't read The Silence of the Lambs, but I have seen the movie. I don't know how good an adaptation it is, but I would be interested in reading this, I think. Yeah, so it is like the second one. But I wouldn't be opposed to, like, getting a second-hand copy of Science of the Lambs and giving these a read. That could be quite good. I've had really good things about this. Um, so what do I know? Because I don't want to read the back. But Science of the Lambs is about, like, the serial killer who works with the FBI to catch a different serial killer. Um, and his name is Hannibal Lecter. And he is really creepy. And I believe he is a cannibal. Okay, next. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Such Sharp Teeth by Rachel Harrison. So we've got a signed book plate to go with it. This looks cool. So this is Such Sharp Teeth by Rachel Harrison. And it says, Rory Morris isn't thrilled to be moving back to her hometown. There are bad memories there. But her twin sister Scarlett is pregnant and needs support. I have definitely heard this synopsis today. So Rory returns to the place she thought she put in her rear view. I know where I heard it. Hang on, I'll tell you at the end. Let me finish telling you what the actual book is. <laughs> After a night out at a bar where she runs into Ian, an old almost flame, she hits a large animal with her car, and when she gets out to investigate, she's attacked. Rory survives miraculously, but life begins to look and feel different. She's unnaturally strong with an aversion to silver, and suddenly the moon has her in its thrall. She's changing into someone else, something else. But does that mean she's putting those close to her in danger or is embracing the wildness inside her the key to acceptance? This darkly comedic love story is a brilliantly layered portrait of trauma, rage and vulnerability. Now, I'm pretty sure that this was in the Goodreads Choice Award. I'm pretty sure that when I was doing the Goodreads Choice vlogs, which if you haven't seen, I did a post earlier, to, um, well, it was earlier today, so like two days ago for you, I am not doing anymore. I'm just going to draw a line under that it's taking me too long but i was looking at alternatives and i'm pretty sure that was one of them and that sounds really good and i really love that cover so that's really exciting cool there's one more thing in there jay i think what's this oh amazing oh sorry i forgot to put my phone on silent so you all just heard levi uh this is bored gay werewolf by tony santarelli um obsessed with this cover that is amazing it's purple, purple and green. Mummy's two favourite colours. One of my favourite colours is purple and green. That is so cool. Okay, I've never heard of this, but I'm intrigued. Let's see what it says. Brian, an aimless slacker in his 20s, works double shifts at his waiter job, never cleans his apartment and gets blackout drunk with his restaurant comrades, Nick and Darby. He's been struggling to manage his transition to adulthood almost as much as his monthly transitions to a werewolf. Really, he is not great at the whole werewolf thing, and his recent murderous slip-ups have caught the intention of Tyler, a millennial were-entrepreneur determined to explore exponential growth strategies in the mythological wellness market. I... yes. <laughs> Instantly yes. 
Tyler has got a plan and he wants Brian to be part of it and weirdly his brand of self-help punditry actually encourages Brian to shape up and to stop accidentally marking out bad tippers at the restaurant as potential monthly victims. But as Brian gets closer to Tyler's pack and drifts further away from Nick and Darby, he realises that Tyler's expansion plans are much more nefarious than a little lupine enlightenment. Big hearted, goofy, anarchic and funny, Board Gay Werewolf is a smart take on the doomsday logic of late capitalism and the complicated meeting point of masculinity and sexuality. That sounds so good! I have never heard of this. What an excellent pick for Pride Month too. How cool does that look? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was a weird face that you just you see my face? <laughs> it's cool, isn't it? Mm, yes, with the... Like, that wolf. Um, yeah. So this, after a bit of a dud last month, this is a much better. We've got two really good sounding werewolf books. Maybe there's a vlog in there somewhere. And also a book that I am interested in, but I would need to read the first one first, obviously. But I would need to get it, but would be wanting to read it. So I'm going to keep that. So I would say that that is a win. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. I generally don't know which one I'm more excited for. It's one of these two. Um, but I don't know which one, they both let sound me, amazing. Let me see which one I want you to read first. Good choice. <laughs> so that's it from us. It's a pretty short one this month, but we were on it, weren't we, with the unboxing? Just all over it. Like this. Boom, 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 boom. And then we, we found some books. We did. We found some good books. Yeah. High five. That was... That was awful. Why? <laughs> there was no slap. Come on, try again. Yes! <laughs> that was a good one. Yes. In the comments below, let me know any thoughts you have on the books that we hold this month. Um, I'm sure this was in the Goodreads Choice Awards. Let me know. And if you've heard of this one, please let me know. Because I don't know how this is like not been on my radar. If you just wanted to know you're here, that pepper heart is always appreciated. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you're not already subscribed and you'd like to see more bookish content from us, Hit that button, leave a like if you want to, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye! Bye. This darkly comedic love story is a brilliantly layered portrait of... Nah. This darkly comedic... <laughs> then a little looping... <laughs> big hearty... Wow, I can't speak. <laughs> so, that's it from us. A short one this week. Week? <laughs> <laughs> Mum! Mum. It's a short one this month. Short one this month. <laughs> Let me know your thoughts on any of the books that I received this. Well. Let me snore. Well, how far? <laughs> that was a big sigh. Are you okay? <sighs> I'm just so uh, hot. Yes. We'll get you a cold bath in a minute. Right, are you ready? <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> I love you. Love you too. In the comments below, let me know any thoughts that you have on the books that I. Uh, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Why can't I speak? Oh. Let me know if you have any of the thoughts that we. <laughs> Not a thought in Mummy's brain. Not a thought to be had. If you have any thoughts. <laughs> <laughs> the books that we have then yeah okay let me, try, <laughs> let me try again now that you've coached me let me try again ready bye 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 bye, bye. 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 <laughs>